their game. The rules are simple. I'll give you hints about a country and show you its flag little by little. You'll have limited time to guess and the faster you do, the more points you'll earn. Add up your scores from each round to see how well you do overall. Let's test your knowledge of countries. Are you ready to play? Let's go! This country is home to the world's largest coral reef system. Well done! It's Australia! Comprising of more than 2,900 individual reefs, the Great Barrier Reef is the largest coral reef system in the world. Let's reveal the next hint. The clearest lake in the world is situated in this country. Yes, it is New Zealand. With visibility proven to extend up to 70 to 80 meters, Blue Lake in Nelson Lakes National Park boasts the clearest water on the planet. Let's move on to the next country. The world's longest coastline is located in this country. Yes, you got it right. It's Canada. The coastline of Canada extends for 202,080 km. On to the next country. This country is home to the world's oldest religious site. Did you guess it? The answer is Turkey. The world's initial religious site is Gobekli Tepe. Let's reveal the next hint. The second largest museum on the African continent is situated in this country. In case you missed it, the answer is Tunisia. With its impressive collection of Roman mosaics, the Bardo National Museum is the second largest museum in Africa. Time to reveal the next country. The world's largest production of olive oil comes from this country. Correct! The country is Spain. From 2016 to 2021, Spain accounted for approximately 44% of the world's total olive oil production. Let's move on to the next country. It is claimed that this country is the world's first carbon-negative nation. Yes, it is Bhutan. With over 70% of its land area covered by forest, Bhutan's constitution mandates the preservation of at least 60% of the country's forested area for future generations. Let's check out the next country. The world's first female Prime Minister was elected in this country. Just in case you didn't get it, it's Sri Lanka. Sirimavo Bandarnake was the world's first woman to be democratically elected as Prime Minister. Moving on to the next country. The world's largest ball of twine is located in this country. Bingo! The answer is United States of America. In Cocker City, Kansas, the largest twine ball constructed by a community is located, while in Darwin, Minnesota, the largest twine ball created by a single individual can be found. Time to reveal the next country. This country is the oldest republic in the African continent. In case you're still guessing, it's Liberia. Liberia is regarded as the first and oldest modern republic in Africa. Let's move on to the next one.
The world's tallest twin skyscrapers are located in this country. Spot on! It's Malaysia. The Petronas Towers, which are the world's tallest twin skyscrapers, held the title of the world's tallest building until 2004. Let's reveal the next hint. Eight out of the top 10 highest mountains in the world are located in this country. Well done! It's Nepal. This country is also home to Mount Everest, the world's tallest mountain peak which stands at a height of 8,848 meters. Let's check out the next country. This is the world's largest landlocked country. If you haven't figured it out yet, the answer is Kazakhstan. It is also the ninth largest country in the world by land area. Moving on to the next one. The world's oldest continuously operating bookstore is located in this country. It is Portugal. Livraria Bertrand, a bookstore that opened in Lisbon in 1732 holds the distinction of being the world's oldest continuously operating bookstore. Let's check out the next one. This country is the largest landlocked nation in Europe. To clear things up, the answer is Belarus. It shares borders with Russia to the east and northeast, Ukraine to the south, Poland to the west, Lithuania to the northwest, and Latvia to the north. Let's reveal the next hint. This country has the largest forest area in the world. Yes, the country we were looking for is Russia. Russia has around 815 million hectares of forested land. Let's check out the next country. The people in this country hold the title for being the tallest in the world. Nicely done! The answer is Netherlands. On average, males in this country have a height of 6 feet while females have an average height of 5 feet 7 inches. Let's move on to the next one. This country claims to be the true originators of the necktie. In case you missed it, the answer is Croatia. During the 30 years war, Protean soldiers were known to wear a necktie which is believed to be the origin of the necktie. Let's reveal the next hint. This country has a national flag with different obverse and reverse sides. Yes, it is Paraguay. The national flag of Paraguay has two different sides with one displaying the national seal and the other showing the seal of the treasury. The design of the flag was updated again in 2013 to reflect changes in these two seals. On to the next country. The world's most expensive cheese is produced in this country. Did you guess it? The answer is Serbia. Pure cheese made from a blend of donkey milk and goat's milk is widely regarded as the world's most expensive and rarest cheese. Let's check out the next country. The world's tallest wooden altar is located in this country. Just in case you didn't get it, it's Slovakia. 
The Basilica of St. James in Levoa houses the world's tallest wooden altar which stands at a height of 18.62 meters. Let's move on to the next one. This country receives the highest number of international tourist arrivals in the world. Spot on! It's France! France is the most visited country in the world with an estimated 89 million people visiting annually, many of whom come to see the famous Eiffel Tower. Let's reveal the next one. The world's largest solid gold Buddha statue is located in this country. That's the one. It's Thailand. The Golden Buddha statue of Thailand weighs 5.5 tons and stands at 15 feet tall. Here we go to the next country. National slogan of this country is Pura Vida, which translates to Pure Life. In case you're still guessing, it's Costa Rica. The phrase Pura Vida is not only a national slogan but also a common greeting used in the country, conveying a message of enjoying life to the fullest and avoiding stress. Let's move on to the next one. This country's national flag is the only one in the world to feature a Bible. That's the one. It's Dominican Republic. Its national flag features a Bible placed in between two palm leaves. Let's reveal the next hint. The world's largest exporter of copper is this country. Yes, the country we were looking for is Chile. Chile is the world's largest copper exporter, accounting for approximately 30% of the world's copper production. On to the next country. This country can see both the sunrise over the Pacific and sunset over Atlantic from the same spot. You guessed it right. It's Panama. In addition, the man-made Panama Canal enables easy passage for ships between the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans, providing a convenient connection. Moving on to the next one. A writer from this country coined the term robot. Congratulations, you got it. It's Czech Republic. In 1920, Czech writer Karel Epe coined the word robot and used in his play called Rosam's Universal Robots. Let's reveal the next hint. The world's largest pair of shoes is located in this country. To clear things up, the answer is Philippines. The world's largest pair of shoes known as the Giant Shoes of Marikina measure 5.29 meters long and 2.37 meters wide. Let's check out the next country. The highest number of vegetarians in the world reside in this country. Well done, it's India. India has the largest number of vegetarians in the world with nearly 30% of its population adhering to a vegetarian diet, and the country boasts a diverse and delicious range of vegetarian cuisine. Here we go to the next country. The world's largest producer of cocoa beans is this country. In case you missed it, the answer is Ivory Coast. Côte d'Ivoire produces over 38% of the world's total cocoa production. Let's move on to the next one. The national symbol of this country is a musical instrument, a distinction unique to this nation. That's the 
one. It's Ireland. Harp is the national emblem of Ireland, symbolizing the country's rich musical history and cultural heritage. On to the next country. The world's oldest skyscraper city is located in this country. In case you're still guessing, it's Yemen. The city of Shibam in Yemen is recognized as the world's oldest skyscraper city. Time to reveal the next country. The only ancient wonder of the world that still exists today can be found in this country. Nicely done. The answer is Egypt. The Great Pyramid of Giza located in Egypt is the only surviving ancient wonder of the world and is considered a marvel of engineering and construction. Let's check out the next country. This country is home to the world's oldest civilization. Yes, you got it right. It's Iraq. The Mesopotamia civilization is regarded as the world's oldest civilization. All right. Before we go, let me leave you with one bonus challenge. Can you guess which country this flag belongs to? Comment your answer down below and let's see who gets it right. Before we wrap up, let's not forget the most important thing. Despite our differences in nationality, language and culture, we are all humans sharing this planet. We should strive to build unity and respect for one another, regardless of our backgrounds. At Extra Mile, we believe that learning about different cultures and traditions can expand our horizons and help us better understand one another fostering greater unity and connection in our global community. Thank you for watching and expanding your horizons with us today. Stay safe.